What is up guys? It is Hayley, Mac Athlete here and today we are doing QTube with Hayley. We are touching on the deadlift. So we're going to go over everything with the technique, tips, cues, everything you need to know about mastering and progressing with your strength over time strategically. It's a lot more complex than you would originally think, so let's get into it. So my basic cues that I think of when I am deadlifting is I want to be positioned underneath the bar with the bar pretty much over the middle of my foot. So once I'm there, I'm actually not going to bend, I'm going to hinge at the hips. Hinge at the hips, bring your ribs to your um, hips, ribs to your hips, and then we are going to choose whatever grip I go under over just because my grip feels more comfortable that way to whatever you prefer and then I'm going to leverage down keeping my knees out so that tension is staying out like that grabbing the bar lowering my hips bracing my core keeping my spine neutral and pulling up here here all right, now I'm gonna to touch on some really, really common mistakes with the deadlift in terms of cues and techniques. And during these videos, if you can't pick up what I'm doing wrong, the truth is you're probably actually doing these yourself. So take careful note. All right, so I'm approaching the bar and I'm going to demonstrate a couple of really, really poor form and techniques that is very common uh, when I'm training people and that I have actually made myself in the past. So as you can see, I'm approaching the bar wrong, and there you go. My hips are way too low in this movement. Not happy. <laughs> so next off, um, my hips are too high. So commonly, people will try and pull from this um, angle, which will actually cause some serious injury if you do go through with that lift. Okay, so there I just tried to bend over and pull the bar up. And now the bar is way too far from my body, which is also going to impact. A few minutes later. So after that little mishap, I'm going to demonstrate a few of uh, really strong reps and demonstrate and break these down in a moment. Now notice that my spine is neutral and doesn't bend through this and I'm pushing the ground away with the power from the movement on the way up. So at the start of the movement I'm keeping a very neutral spine as you can see here which helps me pull the slack out of the bar. So I'm doing this by engaging my lats and my scapula and retracting that properly to be able to forcefully pull up and not use my upper body. So when it comes to the deadlift, it is so, so important that you actually master the technique before you go and throw the weights on. Because if you don't, that is how you will sustain an injury and then continue to have bad form throughout the rest of the movement. So key things is to really, really work on your core and bracing. Bracing is one of the most common mistakes people don't do. And without bracing, your core won't be engaged and therefore your lower back will take all of the load. So if your lower back is aching after your deadlift, truth is you probably have a really, really weak core and you're not activating correctly before you're starting the movement. So guys, that is it for QTube with Hayley. I hope you enjoyed and we'll see you next episode.